Live, the one and only Local 10 News starts right now. Developing off the top tonight, what's the safest way to bring students back to the classroom during a pandemic? That's what South Florida education officials are trying to decide with the help of parents. At least one superintendent saying they're not ready to reopen in Local 10's Leanne Motorhon has what is being recommended at this hour. Leanne. No, it's not. The We're just over a month away from the start of a new school year, and it seems the leader of at least one South Florida school district thinks kids should start the year learning from home. I am recommending that instruction will be 100% e-learning. That is the only way we can educate our students while keeping them and their teachers healthy and safe. Broward School Superintendent Robert Runcie believes cases of COVID-19 need to decrease and level off before students can return to the traditional classroom. But as it stands, the positivity rate in South Florida is sitting higher than 20%. Runcy expressing concern along with medical experts Tuesday at an online workshop. But I do think a decision to open face to face now would be uh, number one premature. And if it was a face to face, uh, that, that would be a mistake. Of 132,000 parents recently surveyed in Broward, 32 percent want to continue online learning. 35 percent prefer a blend of online and in-person learning. And 31 percent want to learn face to face. Surveys for parents in Miami-Dade are due Wednesday. And while Superintendent Alberto Carvalho has not gone so far as to make the same recommendation as Robert Runcie, the district did release a statement today saying in part, we recognize that the ideal way to educate children children is face to face in a classroom setting. However, the safety and well-being of our students and employees remain among our top priorities.